What's up everybody? Welcome back to Supreme Tech. In this video, I'm going to show you how to be able to watch and edit your iPhone footage on your Windows 10 computer. If you're like me, you have this problem where you record on your iPhone, um, you know, whatever you're doing, you could record, uh, I just do tech videos, but you could be recording anything, right? And then you plug in your iPhone to your computer, you transfer the files over, and then they're MOV files, right? And you can't view them on your Windows computer. You can't do anything with them. You can't edit them, view them. Um, it just keeps popping up error code. So in this video, I'm going to show you exactly how to make this problem flat out go away. Um, you do need to have one thing for this, um, and it's $1. That's all you need, $1 um, and a credit card, obviously. You won't get charged monthly or anything, and it's through Microsoft. So... So there's definitely nothing to worry about, you know, getting scammed or anything. It's through Microsoft. So let's just jump right into the computer and show you exactly how to do that. Uh, but before we do, if you're new, make sure to subscribe, smash that like button, and turn on them post notifications. It really helps out the channel. With all that said, let's hop onto the computer and show you exactly what you got to do. All right, so I'm pulling up my file manager and um, what I do, and the same as a lot of people, might you might do the same. You know, you plug in your iPhone, you move the files to your PC, right? And then once you get to your PC, um, you'll see the files look like this here. Um, it, it, you know, it doesn't show the actual video. Like you see here, it's got a thumbnail. Um, it doesn't show any of that and it says it's a MOV file, right? Um, when you try to watch it, it just shows an error and it doesn't work. It says error code, whatever it is. It just, it, it wouldn't let me do anything. And then when I'd open DaVinci, if I'd come over here and click import media, it wouldn't let me import it. Just nothing would show up. Okay. So what I did was I watched a ton of different videos on YouTube and I found a way that works a hundred percent of the time um, but like I said you gotta buy an app from Microsoft so what we do is you'll come down here and search Microsoft Store and you're just gonna open it up and once you open it up what you're gonna search for in the top right here click search alright so what we're gonna search for here in the search box is HEVC video extensions from device manager um i already have it so it's right here it might say from device manager it might not i already have it so what you do is you just it's say 99 cents to buy it and what this does is it plays high efficiency video coding which means hevc videos in any video app on your windows 10 device this is what lets you do it in DaVinci Resolve, um, HitFilm, any any app that you're viewing this or editing it. Um, so all you got to do is just have a dollar on a credit card. You know, you could have only two dollars left. Just put that dollar in, get it. Um, if you don't have a credit card, maybe ask somebody that you know um, or if your kid, ask your parents. But I guarantee this will work for you. If you have any other questions, make sure to put them in the comment section below. I'll be sure to get back to you. But this guarantee works. And you don't have to go through all the hassle of converting files, which takes a lot of time. So you just, you know, scratch that whole thing out. You don't need to uh, convert, right? You just literally can use anything on any app on your Windows 10 device. So you just, let's shut this down, pull up our file manager, and you'll notice that once you do this, you're going to want to close everything down and then restart it. But once you do, you'll notice that these looking um, videos, they'll turn into these ones where you can actually see the thumbnail um, and it'll still say MOV file, right? Before you couldn't view it, so it had this. Um, but now you can actually see. That's how you'll know it worked. Um, or you can come open DaVinci. 
and try to import. Let's see that one I was looking at. You can see it says MOV file. Let's click on it and it just adds right in. So that's the simplest way I know how to do this. You guys can try the uh, VLC media player and try to convert it. But honestly, that takes way too long. So if you have $1 to spare, this is the way to go. You don't have to keep renewing the subscription every month. It's a one-time fee of a dollar and you'll have it on your system for as long as you have the system, right? So like a lot of people, I tried to use VLC media player to convert it. So what I did was, you know, go to media, convert, so you'd pick a file, right? Pick a file. And then what you do is you click convert. And I tried to convert it to MP4 because MP4 always worked. Um, that didn't work for me. I hope this video helped you guys out. If you, you know, have an iPhone and you edit on your Windows computer. Um, again, let me show you what this is. It could look like this here where it says from device manufacturer or it looks like this here HEVC video extensions but that pretty much does it guys I just want to show you how to get your iPhone footage working on your computer again this is to view it to edit it anything you want to do any app on your computer quick note if you don't restart the program so like say you are using DaVinci if you don't you know save it and then exit out and reboot it then it probably won't work until you do that so make sure you do that for all your programs um, if you want just restart your whole computer um, then that should 100% work okay if you're having any trouble again throw it in the comments below thanks for watching everybody and I'll catch you in the next one